So let's try a character. Um, we can't afford the Asunta. I still think it's kind of bullshit that we have to pay for the random option. That, that, that kind of seems like it should just be, you know, a thing that you, you get. So we can take Gallo or we can take Red Death. I think I might grab something and then try and go for relics on like a new stage. Let's take Gallo. So what does Gallo look like? Got better duration, better cooldown. Doesn't have the the greed, but gets more rerolls and skips. Okay, so he's better on duration and cooldown. That makes sense, given that Clock Lance it's his default. Um. Do I want to go for... Let's go for one of these relics. Um, let's try the bone zone. I might... Ooh, do I want to put hyper mode on? Yeah, we'll leave hyper mode on. It, do, it doesn't seem to actually increase the difficulty very much. We'll put hyper mode on. We will turn hurry off for this one though. So we're going to try out the bone zone with Gallo. What is this place? Um, don't know if we're going to get that with Gallo. Dura I'm thinking duration. Duration is good with Clock Lancet. <clears throat> um, Rune Tracer is good if we're talking duration. I mean, it's just good in general. So is this just going to be all skeleton-themed enemies? Oh dude, I love the music. I mean, I love all the music in this game, but... We're going to be stacking duration, so Bible. Because that gives us... Uh, we're going to be taking Spellbinder. Alright, let's take a look at the map. Oh, Relic, and it's close, so we'll grab that Relic. Wait, is it moving? I was definitely directly above it before. We're getting close. Should be somewhere around here. Should be very near around here. Um, what do we want? <sighs> Let's do Laurel and Clock Lancer on this stage. Wait, is that... Wait, is that the relic? Is it in that? Is that why it's moving? How do I... Do I have to def destroy that thing? Can I destroy it? Oh shit, shit. Taking damage, taking damage. I've been neglecting my level ups to chase this thing around, and now I get here and I find that it's whatever the hell this is. Um. Well, we'll hang around. We'll just we'll just hang around it and level up here, I guess. Oh shit! Spellbinder, yes. 
You want Spellbinder. Is there any chicken around here? Um, what are we working on? His natural strength, duration, and cooldown. Song of Mana is just generally pretty fantastic. Um, well, I'll keep leveling Rune Tracer for now. No healing. Where's that relic? Has it moved? I think it just moves back and forth down here. Oh, jeez. Walk straight into that. Duplicate it. Um, we'll take armor. We'll need that for our rune tracer evolution. Oh shit, okay. Bracelet. Let's try the bracelet. Does it say anything about the bracelet and the grimoire? Because I've seen that you can evolve that. Wait, bracelet and the... How do you get that second one though? Is that another item? I mean, it says that I have it. It says that it's available. And it doesn't even show me needing a second object to uh, evolve it. Is there just no healing in this stage or something? Is that why it's like a bonus stage? It's like a challenge? Or am I just spectacularly unlucky? Um, guess we'll evolve the clock lancet. He's got lots of rerolls, so let's try them. <laughs> we might as well use them. Oh shit, shit, shit. Yeah, I'm starting to think there might just not be any healing on this stage, because I've I've destroyed so many light sources and I haven't found anything. Either my luck is hilariously bad, or that's just the challenge aspect of this stage, is there's no healing. Oh, treasure chest. Can I get to it through all these projectile guys? Um, we're going to have, what, one, two, possibly three spare spaces. Well, let's take empty tome, because the tome's really good. Okay, rank of bracelet. Okay, rank bracelet only levels up six times. Oh, yeah, it does look like that uh, ball of skeletons is coming back. Let's try leveling up the bracelet more. I can't even see what thi what the things it's firing are, but shit, they got me. Revive. Use our invincibility to grab all this. Shit. Oh, there are those uh, skeleton cat things. I think there's a new one. I don't think I've seen those before. Oh, yeah, there it is. I'm still. <laughs> not confident in my ability to actually break through it. Sand to water would probably get me a bit more breathing space. Good with duration. I'm thinking maybe sand to water. Right now I just I need more safety and I don't have much I don't have much safety right now.
I'll worry about that ball of skeletons when I can actually confidently survive. Fuck. Shit, shit, shit. I was expecting those guys to die a lot faster than they did. Um... Oh, jeez. So I need the attract orb. But that's about it. Let's take Tarona's box and I just won't level it up all the way, because that's a pretty powerful buff. They're funneling me up and away from all the experience. And I'm probably going to need a second revive. Yep. Jeez. Oh, wait, I don't have a second revive. Oh, damn. That was it. Ah. Oh. I don't know if that guy's too fragile, my build's just crap, or what the story is. But let's try it. Let's try it again. Do I want to try it again with him? We'll try it. We'll give it one more try with him. See if I have a bit of a better idea what to expect now. So I'm not going to sacrifice my early game levels for um, uh, dura yeah, duration's good. We want duration to go after that relic because I know I can't get it anyway. <sighs> Seriously. Bible. Good. Oh, okay, but Bible maybe not so... Maybe not amazing for the start, actually. Okay, we're doing okay. Yeah. If I don't, if I don't sacrifice those early game levels, ooh, whip. Yeah, I'm thinking the healing. We might, uh, we might want the healing from that. Um. We will do the, um, we'll go for that one again. The Laurel and Clock Lancer thing. Yeah. If I focus a bit more time leveling up instead of chasing that relic, which I can't get anyway, then hopefully I'll be a bit better. I won't be so far behind the curve. Ah, no, I don't think I want any of that. I guess the bone would be thematically appropriate, but... Um, armor, I'm going to want Rune Tracer eventually, because Rune Tracer is just really good. I'm going to level up. I'm going to try and focus on the Bible where I can, because... Um, that's my main way of like not of keeping enemies from getting too close and just killing me. So we're going to focus on the Bible for now. A little bit of damage here and there is not too bad because I do have the uh, regeneration. Um, Spellbinder, yes. We want Spellbinder. Definitely don't want Skullomatic on this stage. Ah, uh, I really want to get my damage dealing weapons up because I feel like I'm falling behind the curve. Empty Tome's good though. We'll take Empty Tome. Shit. Fuck. 
Oh yeah, I wonder what those little blue dots I would sometimes see were. I think it's the um I think it's the clock lance at freezing projectiles in time, which is kinda nice. And yeah, I think we're gonna need that Tirigisu. Whip. I'd probably rather see Bibles just because I actually have the thing to evolve that, but A quick sweep through those yet, yeah, no healing. Didn't think so. Um, for God's sake. I really, really want my offensive stuff leveling up, and it's just not giving it to me. Oh, crap. Oh, for the love of God. Oh, Hollow Heart, I do need that. I can't get any firepower, it's just not letting me level up the weapons I need. It's not giving me Bibles or whips. Shit. Rune Tracer, okay. That gives us a bit a bit more firepower at least. Shit. I might die there. Finally. Yeah, I think I'm going to need a revive here. Oh, geez, there's a big skeleton there. Okay. Dude. I need weapon evolutions. I needed them a while ago. I really need to just take a final secondary so it stops showing me things I don't want. But what do I want to take for the final secondary? What do I want to take for my final weapon for that matter? Okay, chest. Rune Tracer, nice. Okay. No, that's only just getting to level 2. God's sake. I might as well use it. It's really intent on not letting me level up my weapons. And it's all my rerolls gone. Do I just take Santa water? 
maybe crown and pentagram. Let's say crown and pentagram. <sighs> Shit. Okay, that should at least stop it from offering me a whole bunch of fucking secondaries that I don't want. I don't think the pentagram synergizes especially well with this. I, mean, I guess I'm stacking cooldown, so that's it'll work well with that, but just anything that might get these guys off my back, I'm willing to look at at this point. It's, re it's just taking the piss at this stage. Maybe having a character who starts with like a, a weapon like the Clock Lancet on this stage just isn't a great idea. Maybe you just want someone who starts with a better, a better weapon. Well, a more reliable weapon, I should say. This, the Clock Lance is not bad. It just, it's just, uh, it's, it's just serving as like a level sink when I need to be leveling up other stuff because it's all the game will give me. Getting the silver ring actually wouldn't be bad. It does give it another fucking secondary to flood my my rerolls with, but it's a, also a pretty nice buff. So maybe we'll. It's they're pushing me north anyway. I might as well run and grab it. Didn't run away from him fast enough. Let's see if we can double back if there's any experience we're left behind. Dribs and drabs. Nowhere near enough to actually get me any levels. Okay, yeah, going for that silver ring was probably a mistake because that guy is, um... He's very fast and he's not going to leave me alone. So now I'm just under even more pressure. I'm so incapable of making progress here, I'm honestly on the verge of just letting them kill me so I can try again and see if I can get a run with even half decent RNG instead of the crap I've been dealing with here. Because this is just dismal to still be this low level at like almost two thirds of the way through. <sighs> Can I just quit? This runs a this runs a wash. I can't kill anything because I don't have enough killing power. Because I've only been allowed to upgrade my freaking secondaries and supporting weapons. Fuck it. Restarting. Had enough of that run, that was bullshit. I'm tempted to try someone who doesn't have that the clock lancet or like a who actually has like a, a true weapon, but I also feel like I got so fucked by the RNG in that run that I'm gonna give Gallo one more shot. Dude, that was so ridiculous. Every single time I had a level up. <sighs> Alright, we're starting okay, but I thought so last time as well, so... Whip probably would have been better as a start, actually. <sighs> okay. Oh, would you look at that? Actual weapon upgrades.
Hmm. Santa water. I feel like Santa water on this stage, the crowd control. Oh, but then again, the whip for the uh, healing, which I feel is going to be really, really valuable. So we'll go whip. Um, whip. As long as I get something leveled up, I'm honestly not that picky about what it is. Ideally, it would be Bibles, but if I can get the whip leveled up, that's cool too. Just something would be nice. Duplicator. I'm happy to see that. Um, we're starting. We will take Spellbinder as much as I want to level up the Bible. We need it for the evolution. Is it more likely to give you your character's like starting weapon, almost like an affinity or something? Because like it freaking throws Clock Lancet in my face every other level. Doing that last time, the pattern seems to be repeating. It's really insistent on me taking that clock lancet. God's sake. Well, let's banish wings, because fuck wings. Whip. I'll take whip. It just wants me to take Clock Lancet all day, every day. No room for anything else. I like the Clock Lancet fine, but I would like to focus on it after I have the basics to survive. Oh, fuck off. What is its obsession with this? Fine, I'll take your poxy fucking clock lancet. I swear I've never noticed this with other characters before, this constantly just shoving your starting... What is this? Just the only weapon it'll let you level up is your starting one. I guess there's other ones, but I'm not sure which ones I want to take right now. Oh, for fuck. It is every... It can't be random. This can't be random. Clock Lancet is the, at the top of every single level up I roll. It's the only thing it's showing me. Like, that can't... There's no way that's ra... I've never noticed that before. Either I haven't been paying attention or it's just a feature of this stage. But that would be a really weird feature to add. I need to be careful I don't have the Tirugis. It's not going to give me any peace until I've leveled this thing up, is it? Until I get that thing, it, it, like, it's just going to be all Clock Lancet all the time. Oh, finally! A level where... It, <laughs> it's not just shoving Clock Lancet down my throat all day. Oh, no, back. Business as usual. Oh, but we've almost finished whip, so we might actually get health drain soon, which will be good. <sighs> we can just get one more rank in whip and then a chest. Chests don't seem to drop super often on this stage, though. And I think I only have the one revive. I should probably grab the Tirugisu if I spot it, because on this stage I feel like I do need it. Okay, Bible up. Hmm. 
we're back. Back to business as usual. I didn't even think it could give you the same weapon twice in a row on a roll. Maybe I'm wrong, or maybe that's just how much it wants me to have Clock Lancet. We're back to struggling for experience again. I mean, I don't know if I'm playing optimally, but the risk on this stage is so high because you can't heal, conventionally at least. Oh. <sighs> Bibles only just halfway done. Burning all my rerolls just to get offered something that's not the goddamn clock lancet. For God's sake. I know it's possible to get a level that doesn't look like this. <sighs> God, to be fucking kidding me. Fine. It's going to be maxed down in a couple of levels and we have to... We might actually get offered something else. I just... I don't believe this. I know it's possible for it to give me a level that's not just Clock Lancet and nothing fucking else. It just doesn't give them to me. Just every... That was three levels in a row. See if we can hang back. Should have the unholy vespers by now. I wouldn't be having this problem of constantly getting chased away because the Bible stop. Oh shit. They there now fuck off. Give me something that's not a goddamn clock lancet. I was half expecting it to find a way to keep giving me clock lancet anyway, but no, now it's just not going to give me weapons at all. For fuck's sake. What is the RNG on this stage? I've never had this problem before. Finally. Now, if I can just get a chest, they don't seem to drop that often on this stage, so that could be a problem. Oh, big guy. He's probably going to drop a chest if I can kill him, but that's a big if. Because I'm finding it hard to... S <sighs> Oh my god. I mean, I'm sure this stage is meant to be hard, but this RNG is just... It's just stupid.